Welcome to the stories behind fried chicken, where I'll be visiting three restaurants serving fried chicken from different countries around the world. Come with me on this journey as we explore what makes this beloved dish so popular. noodle shop in Shoreditch, East London. They're famous for their bao, their steamed buns, but I'm here for one thing and one thing only, their Taiwanese fried chicken. Hey. Hi, Melissa. Hi, I'm Orton, yeah. Hi, nice to meet you. Welcome, welcome. A amazing space. Thanks. How long has this been open for? Since 8th of July 2020. So I think we're here to make some fried chicken. Yeah, come, yeah. come in, come in. Thank you. I'm Er Chen, I am the co-founder and creative director of Bao. I started Bao with my, my husband Sheng and Wai Ting, my sister-in-law, and then we went on a road trip to Taiwan after we had graduated. We went around eating, traveling, and had the idea of perfecting the Bao recipe. We marinated in soy milk, vinegar, soy sauce, ginger, spices, they kind of like tenderize and marinate the flavor into it overnight. And then on the day, then we first fry our fried chicken, uh, coat it in tapioca flour and our special spice mix. And then when the service starts, then uh, a second fry to order. So here we have the steamed um, sesame bao that we, we make in our bakery. So we have a base meal, and then we add it with our homemade citron chili oil. So it's like tingly, spicy nice, flavor. Nice. You kind of pick two sides that are kind of just over the edge of the bao. And then we have the golden kimchi here that, that we make in-house as well. Golden kimchi is made with juice of carrot, lemon, there's a vinegar, there's fermented bean curd. So it's like nice and golden, generous amount. Over the kimchi, over the chicken, when we first started doing the baos, we wanted to do like a gua bao, which is a classic clam shape that you open up and then you put the fillings in. And then there's another shape, which I think worked better with like deep fry items. So then we, we created this sesame flavor uh, bao. There you go. Here's our fried chicken bao. Thank you very much. We are always kind of fascinated by all these culture in Taiwan or in Asia. We travel to Taiwan, Hong Kong, uh, Japan every year. Urchin, this looks incredible. Tell me about Taiwanese fried chicken. I guess in Taiwan you can you can easily find everywhere on the streets that sells Taiwanese fried chicken in this kind of style, but not in a bao form. You have a bag of fried chicken that might have like deep fried basil and then you can choose different spices that you put on. Wow. No problem. Do I take a bite? Yeah, yeah. Please go ahead. Yeah. <laughs> That's good. It, it makes like it's crunchy, it's soft, mm -hmm. it's got the golden kimchi. I can I can hear it. That mouthful had everything. Yeah. But the yeah, kimchi yeah. really came through. Yeah. And it's kind of all happening in different in different places. It's yeah. Kind of like if you've got the crisp um, but then the, the, with the mayo and everything, it's gonna like soften it and the juice. Yeah, bring sauce. everyone together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, um, that's phenomenal. Urchin, thank you so much for um, letting me into the kitchen. No and problem. Letting me into your fried fried chicken. It's a, it's a dream come true. As a massive fan of your fried chicken. So pleasure, pleasure. Thank you for coming. Thank you.